Oh, goody. All right, what is up, everybody? Zombies here again. And today we are back with another Mercenaries video. Feeling a little bit better today, so I figured do a little bit of streaming and ended up getting a really cool kind of comp submission from Vessia uh, suggesting a human focus build uh, with Trigor, of course, because Trigor is just carrying all these other random comps on his back in a lot of ways. You know, you got to use the Trigor to slay the Trigor. Uh, and, you know, maybe there'll be some other stuff that works out. But for now, it's the approach we're taking here. But other than Trigor, this is a fully focused human comp. And when I first saw it, I wasn't totally sold on it. But after messing around with it a little bit on stream, I really ended up liking it. Like, it was... Uh, this was kind of my first time using Varian since the buffs. I tried him in the past, and he'd been kind of cool in another human's build I kind of liked a few metas ago. Uh, but haven't really tried him much since the patch. This was a good way to try him out. And uh, he actually did really, really well. Cool thing about Varian in this build, splitting strike death blow is actually huge like giving your humans plus 15 attack when almost your whole comp is humans is really really big um retaliation still incredibly powerful at the start i was using war banner for like even crazier stats and there is one game where i end up with like over 100 hp on a variant and it's nuts and like 50 attack or something ridiculous but uh it is a little bit too easy for the opponent to play around a lot of the time, so a lot of the time Charlemagne is just kind of better for the extra attack. That way there's nothing they can do to play around it, and you're hitting in for 20 on turn 1, which is a lot of damage. Uh, Trigor, I mean, we don't really need to discuss Trigor uh, very much. We all know what he does at this point. Just spam skill 2 with item 2. And you're good to go for a lot of additional damage. It can be pretty gross too, especially if you get off a of retaliation. If you're expecting them to attack a bunch. And you get the Trigord triggers too. It's pretty cool. And then Tyrion. Tyrion is pretty good in this comp, honestly. Um, being able to shrink down uh, something to kill it on turn two. Potentially the Trigor, so it's not like zapping you a bunch that turn. Also potentially is not bad, but... We're really also using him for his ability to buff up the bench by plus eight plus eight as Leroy is going to be our predominant way of kind of closing out a lot of these games. And this actually goes for a strategy that's a little bit different with Leroy and looking at him here we're actually running ninja looting and I haven't actually finished leveling this one up yet as I took a little bit of a break from farming but even at level two Plus four attack whenever an enemy dies is a lot of attack in a Kazakus heavy meta. It gets out of control pretty quickly. It's plus six at max, so it would be even crazier if I had this all the way maxed out. Uh, but even at plus four, it was absolutely nuts. Very, very powerful equipment. And I think it might have the potential to be his best equipment now, at least in some builds that are kind of focused around that. And because of that, you often end up using Get Chicken quite a bit more as you want to make sure your Leroy is immune so he can live and get all that attack damage in. Because we had some of the biggest Leroy's I've ever seen, which, if you know me, I'm, I'm a big fan of big Leroy's. I think Leroy is one of the more fun characters in the game. And uh, any excuse to use him, I'm happy to do so. Rogers, just our really good blue, who happens to be a human, gets that benefit off the Varian attack as well. Uh, being able to speed up things like the, the Varian or the, the Trigor sometimes when it's just barely alive but has a lot of attack can be really cool and powerful as well. And then Cornelius is here to kind of, one, keep our backline alive a little bit, you know, help Leroy survive an extra turn or uh, Rogers survive an extra turn, and he gets pretty strong from that uh, Tyrion buff like again 20 attack from a red is nothing to scoff at and you can pretty easily take down some of the big green uh, threats like Sylvanas like Diablo um, and Sinestro when she pops out so definitely been liking Cornelius and he has definitely overperformed my expectations so far 
So that is going to be our overview of the comp here. We're going to get into the games with it. Before we do, though, if you enjoyed the content, do remember to like and subscribe. It does a ton to help out the channel and keeps the Mercs videos coming. Without further ado, let's get into the games. Three greens, eh? Alright, so it's the Valera version, which I'd imagine this should be good against. Let's find out though, I guess. Valyria gonna fan here? That'd be pretty funny. Or is she just gonna pass? Yeah, this variant is huge. Oh, ambush. Well, I mean, that's certainly a choice you can make. 42, 130 varian. Real casual about it. Um, what do we want here? Noticing he doesn't have a blue on the bench. Which is kind of interesting. You like Leroy? Alright. I can get behind Leroy. Oh, death blow, give your humans plus 15 attack. That's pretty sick. That's a cool combo. Job done. And like, you imagine they're gonna be scared of us pressing retaliation again? So I don't think they're gonna go in with the Valera. Oh, Munim? Oh, so he can go in like next turn? Yeah, I guess you don't really need this attack if you're getting this attack. Alright, I'll try it like that. We do miss out on some Trigor damage though, I think, that way, but... Maybe, we probably won't need it. Trigor, I guess, did, did its job, right? Oh, I lived at one. Be a hero. A zero. Yeah, ninja looting would be pretty sweet there, for sure. I thought about uh, trying it out. But I still have to level it a little bit more. Maybe I'll do that off stream tonight. Maybe I'll finish Leroy. Because I love Leroy. He's just so fun to play with. This is a cool build, though. I'm digging it. Thanks for the suggestion. And we can just smack him pretty damn hard, huh? Yeah. This Valyria is like the scaredest Valyria I've ever seen. <laughs> like, look at that, just staring down a 57 attack variant. Like, Jesus. So we definitely go with the Leroy. I guess we try and kill the Valyria. Why not, right? Or we can do that with this, and then, like, I think Kazakus is the only thing on their team I'm, like, super scared of. Job done. The Valyria would give me more attack. Which is kind of cool. I think this is less greedy, though. Oh, 
Okay, please don't murder our Varian. Thank you. Let's see. Corn is pretty tempting here. Enter Sylvanas, sure. Uh, maybe I should have sent in Rogers so I can insta-kill the Sylvanas. That might have been the move, actually. Hindsight. We can protect this, though. And then just go off with Leroy next turn. Although, we if we attack, we just, like, kill something. Which is maybe a bit less greedy. And then, the other question is, do we protect one thing, or do we just heal both things? Like, we just heal both things. Job done. No. Still immune. I guess we do want to set him up to just, because he'll die earlier if he's not immune. Oh, jeez. Alright. This worked out, though. So we're favored to, uh... To get this, Job done. this is hilarious. This is the biggest. Yeah, he has a lot of attack. That's the understatement of the century, right there, right? This is sweet. This is exactly the type of thing I like to do with Leroy, right? Won't it be favored, though? Because, uh, he'll only have one action, right? And they'll have two. Because the other guys die to Leroy. Immediately. Yep. Nice. Varian lives, which is hilarious. Yeah, this was- this was sweet. This was very cool. Good. And now we can just absolutely look at this poor Diablo who's about to get just like sent into the stratosphere. Yeah. <laughs> Critting for over 170 damage. That's the biggest variant and biggest Leroy I've ever seen. <laughs> Yeah, I feel you, Dinosaur. This is- these are the first games I've played in, uh... Better part of a week. Uh, maybe a little bit less than a week. Five days or so, because I've been sick. And it has been one of the few times I have not felt super compelled to, uh... Be trying new and interesting stuff. Because it's just so hard to, in this meta. It's like, it feels really hard to. Because everybody is running, 
Trigor or Kazakus. Like, you just like have to throw Kazak or Trigor into like everything. I really hope they can, uh. Maybe tune him down a bit or something. Like, it's just. Yeah, I don't know what I had. I still think, I think it might be a sinus infection. I don't know. My sinuses don't clear up in a day or two. I'm going to see about getting like actual antibiotics or whatever. Huh, they went for the eight eights. <laughs> oh, it lives? Ooh. Oh no, it dies. See, now Vol'jin just makes us very sad. That seems to be the big issue with this comp. And they just always have Vol'jin, because it's a Kazakus build. It's like, why wouldn't you run Vol'jin off the bench? It's just so good. It makes a very powerful character even more powerful. <laughs> It's like, what's not to like about that? And then it's like, we still need to kill the Trigor. Job done. And they make big golem, yeah. Like, yeah, these have been some... Pretty boring games so far. Like, this comp is fun, but like everything we've played against has just been. It's like, it's just the same thing over and over. Yeah, like this, this game is not like winnable from this position, I don't think. We just have way. Two good resources. I mean, I guess we just zap, zap this. Job done. Your mother is near. I mean, this is pretty cool. Yeah, Kazakus is just crazy good. Maybe I should have healed there. We just try and set up for this again. Job done. They're just going to shadow claw me now. It's going to deal a lot of damage.
Wow, okay. Okay. If that's Sylvanas, I think we just won this game somehow. <laughs> How did that happen? <laughs> sure, all right. We'll take those. And it was just incredibly unfair. It, it felt so unfair. Swagnarok. That's a fun name. Up, oh, did Harston disconnect me on turn one? Beautiful. Oh. I will certainly not miss this meta. <laughs> I... I had some positive things to say about it for the first few days, mainly because it was just different, right? But, like, no longer. <laughs> I'm over it. I would take Frost meta back over this, to be honest. Job done. So be careful what you wish for, you know? The monkey's paw... But maybe they'll get there. I think we've had some metas that have been fine. It's just they could have been better. I really liked the, the changing of the pace of the releases. So I, I have, I mean, there are pros and cons to both ways. But I really did like how much things changed because of the old release cycle. And I'm worried we might not get as much of that, which is a little concerning. It like, this is stupid. Like, these should not be triggering on things that are already dead. Like... It's, it's stupid. Like... Like, there was just so much nonsense that turn. Like, what do you even, like... Alright, so it's like Arcane back, right? Like, it really looks like Arcane back. So I think we need Leroy out here and set up, and this stuff's gonna die. Oh, son of a bitch, dude. What did I do? Oh my god. Just... I just threw Trigor out there. Or I, I did threw Leroy out there and didn't put him on the right side. Well, that's like, that's like some, certainly a choice, right? <laughs> it's not the correct one. I mean, we still kill the Nefarian. It shows you, like, I'm really not engaged with the game right now. Like, I'm just not, I'm not thinking it through as much as I would normally like to. Oh my god, and it copied Trigor, dude. That's so silly. That's really silly. Show them what we're made of. Lord Enur. I must want to be greedy and like just wild swing. But that can't be right. And like buff him and then go off next turn. We could speed this up and knock into this. It's actually kind of cool. Right? And get divine shield.
and buff the Leroy. Wait, did you see that? He got hit and the divine shield didn't go away. Oh, cause he's immune. He's immune. Oh, that's sick. That's sick. Wow. What's that? 26 and 52? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, sick cheats, right? <laughs> wow. Oh, and we can... Alright, wait. Let's make sure I'm not throwing here. We protect the Leroy. I guess we could just heal it because we can zero next turn and kill. And then we just heal both. Yeah. They just don't have the damage. Nice. We're going to win this even with my throw of a placement. Nice. Boom. Big Leroy damage. Yeah, I mean, the so far, it's really, uh, it's been sweet. It's been, uh, and that's, oh, I'm, oh, I'm only getting four attack off of it, too, because I have the Halfway upgraded one. Hey, we got some good coins. Try and increase the collection without having to uh, craft like everything, but there's not really a big downside to it, in my opinion, if you're going that route. Yeah, but where are they going, right? Like... Like, what's the alternative to to YouTube in 2022? Vimeo? <laughs> like... And don't get me wrong, YouTube has a lot of problems. It's far from a perfect platform, but, uh... Job's done. Odyssey. Yeah, I've never heard of that. Look it up, though. Too slow, too slow. All right, so the, it got distributed evenly. We could opt to go slow. Like punch here. I, mean, I guess it's better to punch here. Eh, screw it. A library. Library, huh. Yeah, I've never heard of those. The big problem, or the problem that I used to hear about, because people have talked about, you know, the issues with YouTube for a long time, 
Um, the big problem that I would see people talk about fairly often. Oh, is this just going to die now? Are we just going to get snapped? Oh, I didn't even think about that. I guess we do this in case. Ah. Well, no, we can just kill this. We don't get the death blow, but I think we have to do it to play around snap. Yeah, I think we just have to play around snap here. Yeah, so they definitely will uh, make Leroy obtainable. I believe it's going to be next patch. He'll become craftable and will be able to appear in packs. I really don't like how they do that stuff with the, the events. I think they handle it in a very strange way. Ugh. I mean, I think we have to do the attack because it will kill the Varden. Hey, you got all the rares? Nice. But yeah, the thing I was saying was, uh... Oh god, Leroy got frozen mid-attack. That's so bad. We couldn't get frozen by the elemental because of the immune, but the death rattle picked Leroy. That's, uh, it's gross. Oh, you have enough for Valera. Valera is great. I was using her a lot in my free to play EU account, and I was very pleased. She was carrying me pretty hard, and I didn't have a lot of characters on there. I mean, we just set up, like, for a big Leroy, right? Like... Job done. But maybe we have to... Maybe we actually have to pop the Jaina. So she dies the next turn. Yeah, Longjin's kind of far up there. He's further up there for sure. Okay, this is actually maybe okay. Nice, yeah, those are those are some decent starting units to max for sure, especially for PvE. It takes a while to do all the, the PvE stuff, like... Wow, we're actually in a pretty nice spot here. Oh, okay. Let's see. I mean, that's kind of fine, though. Because we have a big Cornelius. Yeah, Corn is kind of like a Giga Chad here. I will think about that, and, uh... Get back to you with some advice after the game. I need to figure out what I need to do here. <laughs> Let's see. Do we save the Leroy? Could speed up the Leroy and just like kill something.
Yeah, man, I'd be down. If you have a Discord, if you want to like DM me on Twitch or whatever, I'll add you over there. Like you just go for the heal, right? Because they're gonna. We can't kill the Diablo unless. All right, so that worked out fantastically, actually. Let's see. What are we doing here? Okay, so, well, now we have 50 damage with the Leroy. <laughs> so we just win, huh? Job done. Time's up, let's do this. Big Leroy is so awesome. <laughs> I'm sold on the equipment. I really am. Alright, cool. I'll add you over there. You know what I've been playing recently? Like, the today that was actually pretty fun was, uh... Downloaded the, the Minecraft Diablo clone. Nice. Yeah, th that's, uh... Those are the ones you want, right? You don't really need to use anything else on Trigor. Whoa, what is this? Attention, our opponent is trying to have fun. This is not allowed. It's illegal. <laughs> yeah, but this is cool. This is the first time I've seen Murky. He's gonna get absolutely demolished by this Varian, but... Good on him for trying. Cool art. Marching Murlocs. That's fun. Yeah, I know that feeling. Ordinary. It's it's a relatable feeling. Oh god, it's so disgusting, dude. It's so disgusting. Like, I'm sorry, Murky, you deserve better than that. <laughs> Good god. It's ridiculous. I think we just throw in corn now, right? I mean... Like, I think I can just, like, piggyback off this giant Varian. Pretty hard. Oh, uh, it looks like the bitrate has gone down. Internet's not happy again. Probably make this my last game then, if it doesn't. I mean, I was gonna end soon anyway. Yeah, sorry everybody. Internet's acting up a little. Actually, it's Rogers. Yeah, it does happen, unfortunately. Yeah, poor Murky. He deserved much, much better. Job done. It was good for most of the stream, though, after we got back, so we'll, we'll take those. Oh, yeah, I forgot to get the Divine Shield, to be honest. I thought this was gonna just die to itself, but... 
It's okay. We can just shrink it. Yeah. <laughs> GG. Big humans OP. All right, so we had some pretty great games with this, uh, to be honest. I mean, there were like one or two there where I really thought we didn't have a chance at all. We ended up just kind of like fumbling into a win, even with like a misplaced Cornelius or something silly. But this comp's a lot of fun. If you're looking for a bit of a different direction to go with Trigor, I think this is a good way to do it. Um, all these units, I think, are pretty independently strong. Very in... We aren't really making use of the buffs he got a whole ton, but I think that's fine. Like, he's just good enough at what he does. And we did have, like, an instance or two where speeding up was kind of nice for the humans. Um, this is a buff I liked quite a lot. The fact that you can buff uh, ones on the bench. Pretty cool mechanic. And, as I said in the beginning, Leroy was by far our MVP. Like, Varian and Leroy are kind of the, the, the core damage dealers of this comp, it feels like, for sure. Uh, but Rogers definitely put in a lot of work too. Like Rogers got pretty out of control. Being able to kill one of those end game reds is really important, as obviously that is not uh, Leroy's strong suit. But definitely recommend this if you're looking for a way to make humans work in the uh, the current Trigor meta. But that is going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, do remember to like and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.